This is video shot in our Northeast Quiet Center in Andover, Massachusetts, where we work six days a week across two shifts, often flexing to accommodate fluctuations in volume across any given week. This is our Kiva operation. You'll notice against the back wall are the dock doors, and then proximate to the dock doors are the Kiva workstations. Um, for any given Kiva workstation, we can perform both outbound pick-pack functions as well as inbound replenishment functions, um, and it's terribly important to have that kind of flexibility. People often ask how the robots know where, they, where to go. You'll notice on the floor there are two-by-two two stickers that actually act as a guide for the robots, um, creating a map of the warehouse. One of the things that we really uh, appreciate about Kiva is the ability to handle all different types of product across common infrastructure. We handle everything from guitar picks and jewelry to garment on hanger, um, different types of home goods, shoes, and again it's all done across a common infrastructure which is incredibly important uh, for us from a capital perspective. Okay, for order picking. The orders drop into the station when the worker signs on to pick, and at that point the system sends bots out to find all of the pods that contain all of the items he needs to fill the orders he's working on. The pods combine a continuous stream so the worker is never starved. Here you can see a laser points at the bin of items to pick. He picks it, scans it, and a light lights up on the station indicating where to place the item. He's picking multiple items for multiple orders at the same time. Each of those cubbies is for an order. In many Kiva installations, pickers pick directly into the shipping cart, and so this setup is not exactly typical, but it works for Quiet's order profiles. Here he's picking a garment on hanger for an order. The process is the same whether he's picking t-shirts from cut cases, guitar picks from drawers, or in this case a designer garment on hanger. This is a multi-use station that she's using for picking. There's a good view of the station screen, which is giving her pick instructions, along with a description and quantity. Behind the stations is where the pack process takes place. For many Kiva customers, the pick and pack process are one step, but at Quiet, the high-end packing required us to split the process. As we've mentioned, many of our customers have high-end packaging requirements. We work a lot with branded boxes like these cake boxes. We'll also do things like add tissue paper or stickers, as you can see in this outbound Bonobos order. We deal a lot with fragile items and take steps to ensure proper and safe delivery through any of the parcel carrier services. And once an order is packed, we'll add a logoed packing list and put a logoed ship label on the box. It'll then be taken over to be taped and organized to be loaded onto a parcel carrier truck or delivery to the customer.